guys, today's video is going to be a review on three brand new products from Wet n Wild. First up is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation in the shade Caramel. On the front it says cruelty free and this is a one fluid ounce bottle. Here's what the packaging looks like. It is a glass jar and it has a applicator which I really love. It was so easy to apply this. I got this on the Wet n Wild website and it retails for $5.99 and on the website they have 20 shades available and it says high performing breakthrough formula featuring light adjusting complex to help prevent white cast in photos tested under seven light conditions with and without the use of flash it says specifically made with a matte light diffusing complex to give your skin no filter perfection so as you saw in the demo it was really easy to apply this foundation especially with the spatula applicator the shade caramel matched me really well during application, I decided to do one thin layer to see how much coverage I would get. And I would say I got about a light coverage. It canceled out the redness, it covered up some of my acne scars, but not all of it. So if you're looking for a light coverage type of foundation, this is a really good option if you do one layer. I did decide to go ahead and do a second layer to see how much more coverage I can get. It builded really well and I did get a medium coverage. It covered up a lot of the acne scars I have and it balanced out my skin tone beautifully. It is nice and buildable. It doesn't look cakey after a second layer and I did go back and stipple on a little bit more to cover up any scars that were peeking through. So I do love the fact that it is buildable. I love the way my foundation looks today. It just looks flawless. My skin looks really good. There's no blotchiness, no redness peeking through. A lot of the scars are covered up and I'm really pleased overall. Next is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer. I have this in the shade Medium Deep Tan. This retails for $3.99 on the Wet n Wild website and it's available in six shades. It says, let your natural beauty shine with our selfie tested creamy and luminous concealer. Tested to be white cast free under seven different photo lighting conditions, this high coverage concealer allows only your best features to get noticed. So here's what the packaging looks like. It has a really nice doe fit applicator. This was really easy to glide on under my eyes. It is a bit on the thicker side, but not too thick. I didn't have a problem applying it to my skin. The specific color suits my skin really well, and I felt like it covered up the darkness under my eyes really well. And the very last product is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Press Powder. I have it in the shade Golden Tan. This retails for $4.99 on the Wet n Wild website, and it's available in eight shades. It says, light diffusing pigments give your skin a veil of silky, natural looking perfection in photos. Wear it alone on bare skin or over photo focus foundation for a flawless finish. So here is what it looks like. The packaging is really simple, which I like. You can see the powder through the packaging. Again, something that I really like. I did decide to set my concealer as well as my T-zone today. So this gives a really nice airbrushed look to the skin. I didn't set the foundation because I really like the way it looks on its own. It has a powder finish to it, I would say. So it looks really beautiful on its own. The concealer as well has a really nice powdery finish to it, but I did decide to set it because I do have oiliness under my eyes as well as in my T-zone, and this gives a really beautiful airbrush look to the skin. It's not heavy at all, it's really lightweight, you can build this as well, so it's all about preference when it comes to a product like this. I'm overall really pleased with all three of these products. I love the way my makeup looks today. These are three products that I've been reaching for quite a bit. I really like them on their own. I like to incorporate these with other products, and I just really am pleased with the photo focus line. So that's it for this review. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.